probably dealt with fine much of anything, but look across the street. I guess we don't have to worry about getting killed over here no more. Crazy. Don't know if I put it in the video, but that was there last night. <laughs> You know we gotta get this Christmas wine. I have heard a rumor. Now, purely speculation. But, I heard a rumor that Maybe somebody along the lines of a metal retro gamer or something like that might have dumped off like 1200 VHS tapes to the thrift store. I bet you 10 bucks most of them will end up in that dumpster. <laughs> oh man. So, going to work. Probably won't do nothing else cool unless we find something cool in the way. You ever have one of those days where like you work third shift and like you don't sleep good at all? And you really wish everybody and everything would just piss on off? Yeah, today's that day. I am just not in the freaking mood. Oh, let's, uh, let's get into something. Uh, probably got a busy weekend coming up. Uh, you'll see. But Corey and I are talking about some things. And that should be fun and good. And there's a bunch of scrap right there. I need to go talk to them about that. I'll show you that in the morning. You. Yep. What's up, trashers? So, nothing real crazy going on this weekend. I think the wife's gonna go to one of them crazy book sales where you get stuff real cheap. I'm gonna catch some lunch. Gonna hit some of these side roads, of course, because you know me. But uh, I'm gonna work on some trash cave stuff. I think, I think I'm gonna purge, or start the purge, of my video game stuff today. We'll start sorting stuff out and getting rid of stuff. I need, I need a couple hundred bucks. And I don't want to take it from myself. So I'm going to try to rally up some cash by selling off some game stuff. But uh, I got something in the works, in the plans. Uh, kind of kind of returning back to roots, if you will. Uh, I've been talking to Corey a lot. What's up, Cordini? And uh, I think my man's going to... I think he's officially stepped into the role as my my guy that's gonna keep my ass in line kind of guy like that. I'd have called him a sidekick, but he's not a sidekick. But uh, yeah, we're we're talking about doing some stuff, so I'm gonna try to drum up some cash and get that rolling, and hopefully this will roll into something bigger in the future. But for now, I just gotta see what I got. I'll dig through stuff. I'll show you if I got anything cool, which I know I do. But uh, I figure I probably don't need like 40 of each game console. So I might thin some of those down. Um, I don't really know if I'm going to thin any of the games down. But I might. I don't know. I've, I've kind of like thought about getting rid of certain systems. Like maybe I don't want to collect the original Xbox and then get rid of all those. But then I think about that and. I do want to collect original Xbox. Thought about getting rid of uh, Xbox 360, but I do love Xbox 360, even though I've returned back home to my PlayStation roots. You know, I love it. I don't know. We'll, we'll see what's up. Let's not run these people over at Hardy's. I love me some Hardy's. Anyway, I'll, uh, I'll show you what's up as it gets up. this down. <laughs> so, Corey is in front of me, or he was in front of me, and I bet he's wondering what in the ever-loving hell I'm doing. Are you, Corey? But uh, we're going, well, we're going to go play some magic real quick, and then we're going to go to a storage unit and start packing up some stuff and moving it to his shop. But, upon going to play some magic, I saw that microwave, had to stop and get it. And that was the opposite way of him, and I could probably tell he was looking in the rear be like, where are you going? 
Hopefully it didn't turn around. Anyway, that's all we got going on, boys. What's up? It's a Sunday. About to get hot and sweaty. It's already 93 degrees. Back at the unit with Cordini. Gonna try to try to make some headway. That's that's wood type right there. That's a dark. Looks pretty good. Corey got a bunch. I got not so bunch. He's play with my strap on. Getting it tight. All right. And there we go. Made me roll out all this carpet and measure it and stuff. Golly. Corey works me too hard. So I this in before. Before we talked about. What the fuck? Alright kids, so I'm cruising the street. Apparently there's a branch down across that road right there. Which is not my problem! Oh, look at this. So I'm hitting thrift store real quick. I was about to tell you something, but I guess I'll tell you that in a minute. After we see what we can grab here. Cans moved. Golly, they've almost tore this building completely down. That one, remember? That one. Yeah, that one. It's a guitar. Guitar frets. Hey. Tons of boxes. I'm gonna get cut to shit over Pokemon cards. Best believe it. Truck not just pass. Same damn truck. Still sticky enough to stick to my phone. Got a my best bud. What's up, Marty? Started uh, messing around with VHS. So guess what? I'm gonna get you all the VHS you can handle. They've tore that building out, son. Yeah. Uh, that's nothing there I need. All right, um, going to get some food. There's gonna be a clip after this that was actually recorded before this. But anyway, so if you remember, a few weeks ago I was in this area and picked up an air conditioning unit. So I, that thing's been sitting in my yard for weeks. I got a, I got a hair in my ass last night and I took it and put it in my room to test it. Like I didn't actually put it up in there, but like I set it on the washer and turned it on. And sure as the world, I knew it. I should have recorded it because I knew what was going to happen. Plugged it in, started getting cold, and then damn cockroaches started blowing out of it. I said, wow, wow. So yeah, word of the wise, don't test your air conditioners near your stuff. Which I think only two blew out, and I squashed them, and then I threw that thing back out real quick. So yeah, don't do that. get dinner after cooling off and messing around with Corey. Woo. Boy about gave me a stroke. Maybe I about killed him. Either way, we did some work today even though it's not as much. I don't know, it's weird. It's like we 
We knocked a hole in the storage unit, but then again, we really didn't. But from my calculations, if we got, if we got around the prices that we kind of laid out together, if we got around about what we wanted, we should be sitting somewhere about a grand a piece. And that's kind of shocking considering like we didn't take that much out of the storage unit. So that tells me if we really hustle it and sit on it, kind of go the long dollar route. What's up, Dumpster Marcus? But uh, go the long dollar route, you know, we might turn this around and make about 10 grand together. Who knows? We'll see. We'll see what happens. Well, uh, I've got to get online and start posting the piss, all that stuff. Tonight, I think he's going to blow Facebook up. And I'm going to blow up Craigslist and offer up and let it go, let go, let it go, let it go, let it go. That's not even the right song. Is it? I don't know. Whatever. Uh, but I'm right now cruising the streets going to get dinner. So maybe we'll find some money. Also working on something else. I don't know if it'll happen. It may or may not happen. We'll see. I'll tell you about that when it gets there. Should know something probably in a couple days. But uh, if that does happen, we're going to blow out probably all the scrap I got. Might even blow out Corey's too. <laughs> Corey's got a little scrap out. I'm trying to turn the man into a scrapper. He's got a decent little stack though. But we'll see what happens with that. And uh, yeah. So I probably won't find anything else. But if I do... If I do, I'll turn the camera back on and slip it into this video somewhere. Maybe before this clip. So if you see anything before this clip that looks like I just recorded it, yeah, that's what it was. Ha! Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this. Probably a short video with nothing much going on. But like, subscribe, or do.